already learned so many things related to numbers and in the earlier year we saw that numbers are everywhere any place you look you will see one number or the other for a second look around the room that you're sitting can you see numbers I'm sure and you can see several several numbers everything is related to words or numbers all right so we will continue into this year's mathematics lot of interesting and fun learning is awaiting you but before that let's see what all you remember it's been a long holiday right let's see what all we remember turn your textbooks to page number 46 we learned all these concepts in the previous class but it always helps us to review once I'm sure you remember everything okay the first exercise is write in words and the number is 79 let's see how to write 79 we learned the numbers we learned digits we learned expanded form and we also learned place houses so the expanded form for 79 is 70 plus 9 remember so now once we have the expanded form it makes it easier for us to write 70 9 did you see 79 all right the next example is 105 105 what's the expanded form 100 plus 5 now it's easy for us to write the number name 100 and 5 in a similar manner do the rest of the exercises up to E now the next exercise is the opposite of it so you are given the number names and then you are asked to find the numeral let's take one look at it the first number name that is given is 525 5 hundred and twenty five so we know there is five in the hundredth place twenty in the tens place and five in the ones place remember all these things that we learned last year all right so you go ahead and finish those ex exercises up till e now exercise number three write in expanded form we were doing it just now but there are some exercises to just remind us so let's see how much we remember 327 okay we learnt about one digit number which is 1 to 9 and then two digits number which is from 1 to 9 is one digit 10 to 99 is two digits right then 100 to 999 is three digits okay so this is a three digit number you know so for a three digit number there is hundreds there is tens and then there is ones of course okay so now we are going to see the expanded form 300 300 plus when it cut two comes in the tens room then it becomes 20 the value is into 10 
plus 7. This is how you write the expanded form of 327. Again, you have a few exercises to practice and remember what you have learned. Let's take one more example of a four digit number that is 3999. So this is 1000, this is 100, tens and ones. So how do we write? We are going to write the expanded form 3000. 999. All right? It's easy. The concept does not change. It's just that we've had four digit numbers. All right, moving on. Let's go on to the next page, page number 47. Write the numerals for two hundreds, five tens, and six ones. That is two hundreds, okay, five tens and six ones. Because you learned place value house earlier, this is very easy. So two hundreds, five tens and six ones, okay. So that's how you say two hundreds, five tens and six ones. Let's go ahead and finish the rest of the exercise. So, numbers, the expanded form and also the numerals, that's what we have learnt, we have reviewed. Now, we also learnt that all numbers are not equal, some are equal, some are lesser, some are greater. So, there are symbols to help us, remember these symbols, greater than, lesser than and equal to remember this in page number 47 itself fill in the box with greater lesser or equal to let's look at the 12 13 okay 12 plus 3 13 25 okay so it's 25 greater than or lesser than 13 plus 12 the answer is same 25 remember we had learned that when you add there is no if the answer will be the same there is both ways the answer will be the same so 25 is greater than 25 lesser than 25 or equal to equal to that's the correct answer. So, you can fill in the rest of the box. Ascending. Descending. So, ascending order is when we are like climbing the stairs. From smallest to largest. Smallest, smallest, small, larger, 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 larger. Like almost we are climbing a stairs. Descending is almost like you are getting down a stairs. In ascending, the numbers given are 345, 543, 435, 354 and 453. It's very interesting because everything has 4, everything has 3, everything has five so it's a little tricky but easy remember it's easy okay so we're going to look at what are the they're all three digit numbers so that's the first thing is there anything that is having less than three digit then that would have been the smallest number but now let's see what are the smallest number in this so 3 is 1, 5 is greater, 4 is greater, then we have another 3 and then it's a 4. So let's see between 345 and 354. So 
that there are three digit numbers so we can't do anything so we let's see what's the step two the both the first numbers are same let's look at that is the hundreds let's look at the tens so in tens we find that 4 is lesser than 5 so then we take 345 as the smallest number so now we have to go up so let's find what's the next word, number 354 354 okay now that we've got this now let's see what will be the next number you're remembering right that we are doing from smaller to greater okay so we found the two smaller numbers in this sequence of numbers the next one is this is five four again four so let's take the two four hundreds four hundred and thirty five and four hundred and fifty three so three digit numbers agree the next is the hundreds are same digits equal digits next one there we found the answer so we are going to write 435 next and then comes 453 then the next one is easy 543 okay so in the similar manner you can do the next exercise descending descending order is let's see it is from you're going down the stairs down the stairs okay 471 271 571 371 171 interesting right all the numbers are the 71 group so let's see what will be the highest number all are three digit numbers so that part is clear then in the three digit number which is the highest number let's see so there is four there's two there's five there's three and there's one okay easy so 500 would be the greatest number in descending that is we're going from greater number to lesser number exact opposite of ascending okay then this is ascending is climbing hill this descending is i'm just comparing it so it's easier for you ascending the hill or descending the hill remember learning it in english same concept okay okay so we're going to see 571 easily gets the first price 571 let's see what is next again it's easy 471 what is next 371 again 271 and the last being 171 so we got our answer now on page number 47 this is again easy since you already know it very well we will not go into this write four even numbers between 52 and 62 easy right go ahead and finish this these are easy ones the next one is also name the solid and flat shapes easy now that you're in class 3 you're a master of a lot of things then fill in the blanks with multiplication okay so this is also something that we learned in the last year we can just do read the time add so add and subtract we are going to have two units in this term so we will go into details of that i hope you finished all the exercises that would have been a good review right to remember all that you learned last year that brings us to the end of unit one